N4 H and H here with the FTDX 5000 MP. Hear that guy? Running this level of DSP here. Contour. Get the width narrowed up a little bit. D digital noise reduction. Before he goes, let me hear you what he's. Here's what he's saying without all this. Okay, re-engaging it. Mu tuner or micro tuner. Contour. Width and digital noise reduction. Great example of where those features come in handy. They just make it a lot easier to hear the weaker stations in that grind. Um, you know, the micro tuner or mu tuner, uh, it's right there. You've seen it before in some of my other videos. That's the model for uh, 40, 60, and 80 meters. Yeah, yeah, and um, the here. Now here's the stronger yeah, station. The you know, he's, he's, he doesn't I need any help. But even, let's see what he would be like without it. Matching unit, Hunnan, and uh, I'll find 75, 40, and 20. All right, again, I'll, I'll engage. It does work on the higher band. Digital noise reduction. This digital noise reduction, here, it beats them up there. no matter what level, but there's one. It's a really nice universal antenna. And there's 15. And It'll never sound watery. It just takes the noise out. There's five. Again, so here's without it. Up, and and that uh, NFED replaced it. So, um, there Almost you makes go it sound like that. you're listening to a two-meter um, repeater. But, um, all right, width. Yeah, let's see here. Um, well, I guess you got my comments there. Uh, I'm gonna go down to 1.5k. You got my comments. I'll use that sometimes if we got fighting Q or Mary. The Elecrafts, and, um, like I say, I really like Contour. The people. I find that around yeah. 19 hertz, uh, 1900 hertz product. is usually the best but place. For that on sideband, if I'm trying to pull somebody on sideband, for CW, uh, somewhere around two or three hundred hertz seems to be the magic spot. And uh, you know, really don't even need it on this guy here. He's he's not buried down there. And the micro tuner just helps. Um, oh, and I did have IPO on. If you'll notice, IPO is engaged. Don't need all that extra. Uh, amplification on the front end of the receiver when you're down on these lower bands um, and then of course you can see where if the micro tuner is engaged you see that little UT or micro symbol T there's bypassing it but what it does is let me turn off IPO there you go look at the noise floor so it's a high Q pre-selector so what's going to happen when I engage it Watch the band edges. In fact, let me just center it up a little bit more on the band. Okay, more or less centered up, somewhere along in there. Uh, centered on the display, I should say. Okay, now watch the band edges. When I engage it, you see how it slopes off on the left and right? You're just engaging a pre-selector, tightening the front end. I like to use it for noise reduction. And sometimes I'll intentionally, uh, when you engage it, see it's got settings here. You may hear it clicking over there, the motor running in it, a little servo. Um, or mm, stepper, a stepper, really. Um, so... You can intentionally move away and the noise floor drops, but you still hear the person you're listening to. Okay, so I hope you, help, uh, hope you found that informative. I just had that quick opportunity there to use those features in, in a practical uh, application. Okay, 73 from November 4 Hotel, November Hotel. Sorry about the focus there. There we go. Uh, with the uh, Yaesu FTDX 5000 MP Limited.